Taking you now to Cheektowaga with newly elected town supervisor Brian Nowak, who's hosting his very first town hall style meeting at Maryville High School tonight. Well, nearly 30 residents taking advantage of the opportunity to share their concerns with elected officials, voicing their concerns about everything from road conditions to development projects. And I attended tonight's forum, providing a platform for the town supervisor on his plans moving forward, along with three residents and what some of their concerns are. It's the first of a number of town halls hosted by Cheektowaga Town Supervisor Brian Nowak. Nowak says one of the issues the town is having right now is discussing bonding for infrastructure work, highway drainage and sanitary sewers and road paving. We need to maintain some savings, we need to stabilize our long-term debt and we need to fix our infrastructure and we can do all of those things together. But he says this task won't come without a challenge. We've had a few meetings now where these issues have come up including a four-hour meeting solely devoted to bonding and after all that work even putting proposals from the Republican Party up I'm a Democrat, uh, even putting their own proposals up for a vote, they've been defeated. Regardless, members of the community I spoke with tell me they're looking forward to what his new leadership has to offer. Chictawaga resident Sarah Marmion is concerned about roads. Potholes and stuff and just the general maintenance. Uh, I believe the board, uh, because it's such a split, 50-50 uh, right now between the Republicans and the Democrats. The Republicans have really been blocking a lot of what Brian has wanted to get done this year so far. And, uh, you know, I just want to ask him how he plans to work around that. Resident Suzanne Costa is newly retired and is ready to roll up her sleeves for her community. Her main concern is the water situation in the town. A lot of the streets, they're being overrun with all the, um, the storm water and all the sub pumps dumping in the streets. I like my street, my driveway, half of it gets flooded because our storm sewers cannot handle all the water. And Tom Sweeney says that he has several properties in the Chichawaga area and wanted to see what's going on at the local government level. The effects of a lot of the things we're talking about, like road maintenance and things like that, that I hear a lot about, um, are concerns of ours. We want to make sure our tenants are happy and, and uh, healthy and safe in our community. So want to see how they're going to go forward with uh, addressing these issues. As Noah steps into his new role, he's hoping to invite residents to have more face-to-face -face discussions about their concerns because he feels that this is a more proactive approach.